Hello, my name is James Lunchbox Owens. Hello, my name is Corey Snapbox Keatley. I'm an apprentice scaffolder for SRK Scaffolding. And we're normally on site at 7 o'clock. When we get on the site at 7, we get fully geared up. And then we go in, meet our ganger, and he'll brief us on what's happening for the day. And it doesn't matter whether it's boiling up or absolutely hammering down with rain. And scaffolding doesn't stop. No two jobs are ever the same. Um, you know, we, we could be on site some days uh, putting up internals, other days you could be learning to do roofing lifts, you could be doing rhino deck, um, other days you could be doing a customer care job where you're actually going to people's houses and interacting with the customers and stuff. You get plenty of challenges along the way that you get to try and um, change and overcome. We need to be good with numbers, working out how much kit we need for jobs, um, what size kit we need. Communication, being able not only to talk to scaffolders, to also be able to talk to brickies, people like that, because they might ask you if you can just adjust something so that they can carry on with their job. And the third one would be loyalty. You have to look after the person above you and the person below you, because at the end of the day, everybody needs to look after each other because your lives are in their hands and vice versa. <music> I love the fact that I'm uh, learning a new trade um, and at the same time I'm being able to provide for my family, not only that, uh, the hours are really good so I know that every evening I get to be at home with my children uh, and my partner. I love the fact that I work in a, a fairly small gang which you get to know pretty well and you can have a laugh about. The main things I love about my job are it's a physically demanding job, it keeps me physically fit. And the thing that I like about my job the most is the money. People have a misconception of what um, health and safety and apprenticeship schemes uh, most companies are trying to do now. They're trying to bring the industry forward where the main priority is the workers and the general public around us to make sure that everybody is safe, everybody is out of harm's way and uh, we don't have this big bravado now of we're scaffolders, we work in the construction industry and we do what we want. I tell myself definitely to uh, look into scaffolding um, a lot earlier because I know at 16 years old I certainly thought that scaffolders were just dirty and it was a disgusting job. However, having started it, I realised, yeah, we get a little bit dirty, but the money's very good, especially when you put your tickets and things like that. The hours are good, um, and it's actually a very good, enjoyable, physical job to do. A piece of advice I would have given my 16-year-old self was do this 16 years earlier, instead of being back at college at 30, uh, doing an apprenticeship. But again, it's letting me provide for my family, so that would be my uh, advice to 16-year-old me.